Morning folks, Jeff Jackson here, Alfalfa and Ford Specialist Cropland by Winfield United. I want to take a few minutes to talk with you a little bit about potato leaf hoppers. So potato leaf hoppers are an insect that affect alfalfa. Not just established mature stands, but also seedling stands. Potato leaf hopper is an insect that usually overwinters in the south where it doesn't freeze and that usually comes up on the jet stream every year. So every time we get a southern breeze, it comes up the, uh, the jet stream. Most of the map would say that it's focused along the, you know, the Mississippi River jet stream or up through that channel. You look at the uh, potato leaf hopper infestation maps or what we would suggest would be the hot spots. I've taken my highlighter and made that area a little bit bigger. So throughout my scouting across the Midwest, we're definitely finding potato leaf hoppers do not read the books. So they're getting outside of their boundaries and going a little farther than expected. Now why is this bug such a big deal? So potato leaf hopper is generally like 3 16 long to about an eighth of an inch wedge-shaped translucent green little bug call a leaf hopper for a reason you catch them in your sweep net so take your handy fancy sweep net go out take 10 sweeps look in your sweep net they'll be the first things jumping around hence the potato leaf hopper so take that into consideration these little bugs are wedge shaped. The head's the wide part. Translucent wings will finish their shape on the back side. Now, why are they so important? So these little bugs, will they have a protruding mouth part called a proboscis. They'll get on the alfalfa plant, they'll penetrate the stem with that proboscis and get into the xylem and the phloem, which is the plumbing that run up and down the stem. So basically, they go into the plumbing to get sugars to feed themselves. And once they're done feeding, they'll spit a little bit of uh, solution back into that plant and that's generally the damaging part because that has a toxicity to it. So all of a sudden we, we stop the plumbing. If you see potato leaf hopper burn in alfalfa, it's usually a yellow V shape that starts at the tip of the leaf and starts working its way back towards the, the petiole. So basically what's happening is when they turn yellow, that leaf is starving because we've messed up the plumbing that's feeding that leaf. You might also see leaves that start to turn purple. And what's happened there is, again, we've stopped up the plumbing. That leaf's gone through photosynthesis during the day, and it's turned purple because it has stored sugars in that leaf that it can't translocate to the rest of the plant. So first of all, we stop up the plumbing. We turn yellow leaves, we get purple leaves. We have stunted growth. Because of the toxicity in that plant, we can stunt these plants, and it's not just one cutting or one season effect. We need to be diligent about scouting potato leaf hoppers. You might think they're insignificant, but a two tenths of a ton yield reduction or 20% somewhere down the road could lead to a lot of dollars left on the table. So again, get out there and scout those stands. We're coming into the season where they're starting to move. So I'm sitting, you know, center of the U.S. right now down by Kansas City, Missouri. I went out and swept my field behind me this morning after a rain shower, and I'm finding potato leaf hoppers here at this latitude on I-70. So they're on the move. Maybe you've scouted already and they're farther north by now, but again, you have to get out and scout to know what's going on. So let's protect our plants and these seedlings. The seedling issue is... We need to keep those seedlings as healthy as we can during the start of their life. So in infancy, we can really damage that plant's yield potential if we have potato leaf hoppers in a new seeding the first year. So I guess my message today is get your sweep net out, go scout, check for potato leaf hoppers, take care of that insect if you have them in the field. Uh, there's a whole host of insecticides that you can use that uh, can be applied for those. So just check with your retailer find out what they have and what's labeled for alfalfa and take care of some potato leaf hoppers. So again, it's Jeff Jackson. Quick tidbit today. Have yourself a great day and God bless.